a little worried that I'm gonna cut him too short. Uh, do it. Yeah, do it. Do it, Mr. Pruitt. You should put the marker behind your ear so you can talk to me. No. <laughs> I'm free. <laughs> We're Gavin and Emily. And we bought a school bus to convert into our own tiny home on wheels. These are our adventures. Time to write this week's to-do list. Oh no, it's not this week's, it's this weekend's. <gasps> Take two. Time to write this weekend's to-do list. First up, stay in the deck. Stain deck, done. Time to unbox a ladder. I'm sure you're all wondering, we went with the Stromberg Carlson Universal RV Ladder. It's a pretty standard looking aluminum ladder. All right, item two on the list is attaching the ladder. Now, the ladder posts are pretty long to start out with and we don't want that to be sitting seven inches or so above where our roof deck is because we don't want our height to be too big to be able to go under a lot of bridges and overpasses and stuff and so I'm going to be trimming these down to make them closer to flush with the top of the roof so it'll be more like that instead of like that. So I have one clamp to the table here with a square to make sure that the long side will be perpendicular with the back of the bus and so if I cut right along this line Hopefully it should make a nice flush edge to go on the top. I made it a little longer than I want to to start out because Emily and I are a little worried that I'm gonna cut him too short. All right, now that our ladder is cut to size, we have attached the top of the ladder to our roof deck. Next, we are going to attach the spacers that will hold the ladder out away from the bus. So like this, we'll attach those to the ladder. Can you grab the driver while you're up there? Yes, I can grab the driver while I'm up here. Thank you. You're welcome. No, what do you need? <laughs> Double the ladder, double the success. Thank you for all your help. What do you need? <laughs> Basically, we're just figuring out where these go. Now we're gonna see where we need to drill holes on these. You're doing great. Between there should be fine. Yeah. It would be great if I have like two more hands. <laughs> I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> that would be really helpful. Then we just need to drill a hole straight through. Easy. Just like I did on the top parts. Straight through. Yeah, it'll be great. Nice and straight. Thank you. 
line up the whole bottom first. Cut these to size. I mean, this isn't even attached to anything. I pull this ladder right off. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, you could pull it right off. Alright, so that screw's going to stay in forever, but the rest can totally come off whenever I want it to. Why can't we just attach the bottom? with those drilled in. Well, we can, but we're gonna need to trim the bottom of this. All right, so we looked at the instructions. They want us to attach the posts together and attach those to the bus, but I think that's dumb because then you have to cut everything to size while it's attached to the bus. Way easier to just thread the bolts through, line everything up, and then be able to take the top part off and cut it. Maybe I'll regret that later if my cuts aren't perfect, but my cuts are gonna be perfect. Why are we cutting it? Because if you don't cut anything. The ladder is too ladder long. Is too long. And there's this enormous step. <laughs> so instead we'll cut it so that these will be somewhere in that range. And the bottom of the ladder the is on the bumper. The, on the bumper. Yeah, something like that. It'll be looking real pretty. I'll fight you. <laughs> All right, Emily's first time on the Sawzall. Oh boy. I think I saw the table. Yeah, you were kind of going in a little bit, but that's all right. Alright, let's see how it all lines up. It doesn't. How's it look, camera? Gotta get out of the way. How's it look? Ta -da! It's a ladder. <laughs> Is it very not straight? Why do I keep losing the tape? Work. It's ready to go off now. on we've made it to the part we're most hesitant about which is drilling through the bumper of our bus because this metal is very thick and we've heard of people breaking many drill bits on it sounds like we need some lube <laughs> go slow yeah so I'm just gonna drill a hole and then put a screw in as I go so I don't have to worry about having four screws slightly out of alignment We'll just do them one at a time, right Charlie? Hey bud. One at a time. Do you love our ladder? Do you love our ladder? Me too. These little wimpy screws that come with the ladder are not making it through the bumper, so. New hole, better screws. Bigger hole, better screw. Can't lose. Big dreams. worked. Yeah, well, <laughs> this is going to be where it gets interesting. Oh my god, that's awful. I'm just super glue it. Doesn't need screws. We can 
bolt it instead of screw it. Yeah? Okay, so we gathered up enough bolts that we're just gonna drill it. <laughs> drill it. You were saying? Drill a bigger hole and bolt it. Yeah, if we can slide enough of these miscellaneous bolts through. And we can just nut it from the inside. <laughs> Lube it and nut it. <laughs> Going in blind. You did it! Get a little tighter later maybe, but... That's way easier than screws. Screw screws! Seven more to go. The bolts are in. The ladder is secure. The first climb. Going up. Woo! Oh, I'm so nervous. How'd it feel? Good. The part I'm wor most worried about is the top, but... Was it like wiggly at all? No. How's it getting down? No. Go like this, and then go ladder time. If you are shorter than Gavin, it is harder. <laughs> Party. You know those jobs that you're like, you know, spend an hour doing that today and then you look up and it's sunset. We touched the ladder. Yay! Oh, I'm gonna touch up this thick rubbery paint. Sometimes it's fun to peel the old stuff away. Oh my gosh, that's incredible. To get to the fresh paint underneath. Oh. And that's Henry's Tropical. Paint touch up. Begin. Well, end. This is honestly the most satisfying paint to use because it just glops everywhere. Wow, beautiful. The rest of our roof's a little dirty. This spot's pretty. Hey. I touched up the paint while we were doing that, so that's cool. One more big thing to do this weekend. Figure out how we're attaching everything maybe make some orders so that next week we are ready to go. We just got back from Home Depot, sneak peek of our solar parts that we're gonna use to mount our solar panels. We're still waiting, we're gonna have to order a couple parts because we don't have everything we need yet. So for now, you can look at our pretty ladder. It works like a charm. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, love, love you. you. <laughs> oh no.